Hi guys, it's Peter and welcome to our channel. Uh, today I was gonna run a Sega Master System emulator on my Amiga 1200. And uh, my Amiga 1200, probably you know from my previous video, has some upgrades. Uh, pretty much right now it's running on a Blizzard uh, 1220 at 28 MHz. Uh, with 8 MB uh, uh, fast RAM, which is uh, really neat. Also, uh, emulator, uh, it's good to run, well in my opinion. To play it with a controller instead of joystick, here you can you can change it from keyboard, uh, Amiga CD32 joystick, uh, a standard gamepad. That's what I'm using, and uh, my uh, gamepad has been modified. Pretty much those two buttons A B uh, works uh, that the way it should be, and uh, let's run it. Sonic the Hatches 2. Uh, you will see how well it runs. It doesn't run in a full 60 frame or so, but uh, it's quite enjoyable. I mean, I kind of like it. And uh, Sega Master System. Oh, I mean, this emulator runs. Uh, can run Sega Master and uh, Game Gear. There may be some 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 glitches will will show. I mean, the vi video. There you go. Let me kill that guy. Uh, the frame rate, the lowest numbers, I just saw 43 frames per, uh, per second or so. Which, uh, I mean, it's probably acceptable for something like that. I'm not too picky, to, uh, to be honest. This Sonic the Hatches 2 is the same version as uh, Game Gear, slightly higher resolution. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I lost it. Anyway, that card did did run away without me. Now, well, uh, let's run it. Um, game Gear game. There's a few game. Well, probably you know like already. Um, there's a lot of games. Same games uh, was made for Game Gear and uh, Sega Master. But there's some games which didn't be released on a uh, Game Gear but never been released on uh, Sega Master for example like that uh, Restar Restar uh, yep and when you switch it uh, games from Sega Master to Game Gear it will automatically detect it and will change it here automatically yeah this game actually I really like I do have for uh, Sega Game Gear and Sega Nomad I mean Sega Gen Genesis I said Nomad. Well, it's the same thing. And I do really like that game. It's a lot of fun. I just want to show you how Game Gear uh, games run on this emulator. It, ac it actually runs, I mean, quite acceptable, in my opinion. We can collect it stars like that. To be honest, like I mentioned in my previous video, I didn't know there is uh, some emulators for um, for Amiga uh, series. I mean, I, I, I thought Amiga was not powerful enough to run any emulators, but there are actually, there is a uh, emulators were which can run on the Amiga very well of course with with some acceleration cards in a stack configuration I doubt it will run and let's see let me show you Ninja Gaiden it's also a pretty good game I like it I believe Ninja Gaiden it's always awesome game on any platform uh, It's not quite same as a, a f game. I believe it's not quite same game as a, on a Ninte on a regular Nintendo or so. Maybe they did have a same version of that game. Uh oh, I'm dead. I, I probably talked too much <laughs> instead of playing. Yeah. 
Also on my controllers, since I did modify, I got turbo button if I need it. Uh, uh. There you go. Well, uh, well, guys, that kind of short short video. I hope uh, it was, uh, I mean, enjoyable, useful. If you guys do like it, thumbs up. If you don't want to miss any future videos, subscribe. We will be really appreciate. Thank you.